Congressman from Florida, Congressman Trey Radel. Uh, he has now been charged in uh, D.C. Superior Court uh, misdemeanor cocaine possession after an October 29th arrest. 37-year-old Florida Republican serving his first term in Congress, a winning office last November. What is... What is the latest? I understand he's just put out a statement. He did. He just put out a statement. And let me just read you uh, the first graph, which sort of says it all. He says, I'm profoundly sorry to let my family, particularly my wife and son, the people of Southwest Florida, Florida, I struggle with the disease of alcoholism, and this led to an extremely irresponsible choice. As the father of a young son and a husband to a loving wife, I need to get help so I can be a better man for both of them. And he says uh, later that he realizes that he's disappointed his family, his constituents, but the good news is that now he can seek treatment. Uh, it certainly is shocking, and I have to tell you, it's sort of something more out of the house of cards than, uh, you know, fiction, than, than something that really happens these days in Congress, but it certainly looks like it did. He is a, a freshman, maybe not that well known to people out there, but he uh, has made his name because he is a new new Republican who hasn't been that strident, not sort of a Tea Party guy. Yeah, the and spokesman I for the U.S. Attorney's Office says that uh, the charges come with a maximum 180-day imprisonment mm -hmm. and or $1,000 fine. It's a misdemeanor cocaine right. possession charge. E exactly. And, you know, I, I should also say that uh, he is somebody who many reporters got to know because he was himself a television reporter, uh, before, a local reporter before he went uh, to into Congress and went into to politics. He actually was, was an intern for CNN before that. Yeah, years ago. All right. What a story that is. Thanks very much.